I heard people call me crazy or weird sometimes. But you know what I really think or not? I think ah, uh, I think there's a new screw in my head. Please send help. Um. Uh. Okay, I write this one today. Based on my calculations, right? No jam. Actually, I'm very nervous. Eh? If jam, I want to eh? What time will I reach my club, man? All right, clear traffic. <laughs> Always the best way to start, all right? It's the first time that I'm riding a Class 2B bike for touring. This Intel Jet here right, is more of like a, a sports scooter. Everything feels like a sports bike. Like it, it, it reminds me of uh, back when I was riding my S1000, my CBR. The handling and all that, right? It's really, it's really them sporty. Uh, sporty idea, uh, them nervous. Uh. We're gonna head off soon. It's about 200 kilometers to the town of Malacca. So we're gonna most likely be taking all the small roads. Go and go and test a bit and see how the Ital Jet feels like uh, for touring. We gotta go already, uh. it's, it's, it's really gonna rain. Okay, let's go! SG to Malacca on the Ital Jet Jackster. <laughs> I said, what a way to start your day, right? No jam at the custom, now come in, don't even look like I want to rain already. Oh, uh, what the hell? Uh. <coughs> Shit, man, I took a big breath. Life minus five years. You know, these past seven years of owning the Africa Twin, there are many, many times where I really, really felt like selling the bike. Uh, number one, I don't have a lot of money. Number two, riding the Africa Twin every single day is a bit tiring like in Singapore. I was like hoping that I can get a smaller CC bike. But the main question right, the main thing holding me back right, was always like, will I be able to still go on tours and all that? Like with the smaller CC bikes, like how is it like? And okay, I have to focus on this corner. Woo! Relax, relax. The trip just started. Oh my god, this scooter handles like a freaking sports bike. Eh? Hey, see when the foot panda wear shades on. <laughs> this one real one or not? Let's go. Look at the talk on this. <laughs> let's go, let's go. Not bad, eh, this bike. Oh my god, I'm having so much fun. <laughs> okay, I'm one, one quarter through already, one quarter. <laughs> Three more quarters to go. Just chilling here, having a coffee, taking a break. I'm still... I still have 131 kilometers to go. Two hour, 41 minutes. I think it should take lesser than that. Uh. The whole forkless front suspension into something like this. Look at this. Apparently, it gives you like you know better stability on higher speeds, less vibration on the handlebars. I've been riding for close to I think 170 km for the past few hours. When you are traveling at like 80, 90, 100 kilometers, right? Uh, you try to feel the handlebars very minimal vibration. Quite interesting. Oh my God, guys! Selamat datang Malaka. We made it guys, we are in Malacca. <laughs> Ital Jet brought us to Malacca. I cannot believe it. 400 meter turn left. Why so smelly? Wow! Oh my god! 
Okay, I'm not see that. Don't even need to scan, I can go in through the side. Huh? B something. Okay, condo parking should be okay. Hey, why is it not moving? What the hell? This is so scary. You've got your studio apartment. Your bed is there. Your sofa is here. Your TV is here. Everything all in one place. Very nice. Let's look at this. Okay, you can only open like that. I'll show you all. We are at like level 31. There's a swimming pool down there. This is your toilet. Oh, sorry. It's not the toilet. I think this is the toilet. Oh, smells nice. There are, there are a few places you can visit when you come to Malacca but uh, unfortunately I don't have enough time I have to go back to Singapore tomorrow we're gonna go shower go rest up and then uh, tonight there's only one place I want to go I want to go to the Jonker Street night market ah uh, right Jonker right night market no no oh it's only five five I was in a grab just now on the way to Jonker Street and then the driver told me, you go Jonker Street for what? The night market not open today. I was like... <gasps> so I asked him uh, to bring me to a place like where, you know, a place where he would go to for dinner lah, and then he brought me to this place. The famous Malacca Satay Lok Lok. A little bit like Yong Tau Hu uh, or Mala. Like that. You, you pick the ingredients, then they go and cook. But this time around, they cook in the satay gravy sauce. So basically, you are eating satay but no satay with other ingredients. But I think compared to last time, right, they do it a bit differently now. You have like three options. One is you can cook yourself. The ingredients you can cook yourself with the boiling satay gravy. And then the second option is they cook for you and then they give you the uh, bowl of satay gravy. And the third option, right, uh, the third option very disgusting one. Eh? They, they use like the same gravy that other people used to cook recycled gravy eh, they call it but it's cheaper lah. so they have this rule that once you eat halfway you cannot put your food into the sauce because they're gonna use it for other people anyway now uh i'm thinking right we will still go to jonker street we will still go there walk one around we go and check out like how it looks like now um sad to say it's not friday today it's not the weekends today so it won't be that crowded it won't be that lively but we'll still go and check it out let's not waste the trip <laughs> oh, <yeah>. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> if you go there on the weekend, the streets will be filled with people, food stalls, and all the flavors you could dream of. With me being me, I ended up at a pretty quiet Jonker Street just because I went there on a Thursday. So, once again, I apologize. Uh, if you guys like want to come and check out Jonker Street, remember to only come during the weekends. Or like you come Thursday, ah, then you go, go back on Saturday. At least you can see the night market on Friday. Don't be like me. I'm not a good example. Next time I won't make this mistake ever again. So yeah, I just want to thank all of you guys who are watching. Please be patient with me. The next time I'll bring you all night market. Okay, I'll bring you all go night market. So take care guys, till the next video. Bye-bye.